What's going on YouTube? This is Uriah the Phone Guy here, bringing you a review of the Samsung Infuse 4G. Today I'm going to be covering the overclock to 1.6. I will have a link in the description below where you can get the overclocking kernel and all the instructions to get that flashed onto your Infuse. So let's go ahead and get started here. Right now I have it on default. I don't have it maxed out yet. So it can go all the way up to, as you can see, 1.6 megahertz. So let's go ahead and max it all the way out here and go back here. Start from the beginning. So you're going to notice the lag I was talking about in my last video is completely gone. I mean, let's do that again here. Just grab, pull really fast. Let's try it one more time. I mean, it pretty much eliminates the lag. Of course, you're going to have more battery drainage with the overclock, but so far it's been minimal for me. It hasn't been too noticeable. I still get a whole day use out of it, and that's connected to Wi-Fi and 4G all day. Uh, let's go ahead and do a quick quadrant score. Let's first let's go ahead and get in here and clear out the running applications. Get back into set CPU, make sure it's running at full. Alright, so let's go into quadrant standard here. And, whoops. It's kind of hard to do through the video screen here. Not a full benchmark. And for anybody, anybody that was wondering, I did replace my TouchWiz launcher with the MIUI launcher. I'll also provide a link in the description below. So that way you can download that and get it on your Infuse if you want it. For me, it's been a really reliable launcher. I've had zero issues with it. Um, yeah, it's just overall, it's, it's a good launcher. So we're approaching the end of this thing now. So let's go ahead. Yes. All right. And let's see if I can get in here with it clear. There you have it. Uh, it's got a 2,296 quadrant score. So, I mean, that's right up there with uh, the dual core devices. So just uh, kind of get another take at it. Let's go ahead and run it one more time. should be about the same as last time. This kind of just gives you a better idea. So that way I'm not just running one quadrant score and leaving it at that. I have run about four or five of these so far and it's been about the same so we should see similar results yet again. see what we got in the second go around. So, sorry, I can zoom in here. There we go. So yeah, a little bit higher this time. So it's been averaging right around the same, and that's fully maxed out the CPU. Of course, I don't run it like that all the time. You know, I do on demand, so that way I'm not straining my battery too much. But, you know, let's, what's going on here? It's just my finger. There we go. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, yeah, so this is the overclocked Infuse 4G. I am running the <clears throat> Infused version 2.2.0. Uh, this isn't the latest, there's another one that just came out today. Uh, that fixes a little bit of the GPS issues. I'm not having those issues, so I'm just going to leave well enough alone for now until there's major updates to the ROM. 
Uh, but yeah, this is overclocked. Again, this is the MIUI launcher. Uh, it's got a nice effect if anybody's familiar with MIUI. It's kind of got the iPhone type feel to it. There's no app drawer. I don't use my app drawer a whole lot, so yeah, I just haven't seen the need for it. The folders are pretty nice. Everything's pretty responsive, pretty quick. Um, it's got a little bit of a different themed menu here. You can change the themes. There's only a couple themes available right now that I'm aware of. Uh, you can change your preferences, you know, back up your desktop configuration. So if I restore, if I need to restore it, if I change it up and I don't like it, it'll go back to the way I have it now. It's got a little built in cleanup tool here, which is some of it's in Chinese. But yeah. That's that's it. If there's anything I'm missing here or something that you'd like me to cover in the next video, feel free to shoot me a message or leave a comment. Uh, any questions, feel free to let me know. Thank you.